whole lot calmer. We've got some clouds and we've got a few showers out there, but besides that, it is looking pretty nice out there. And you look out of our downtown sky cam, well, pretty beautiful. 77 degrees, that dew point still at 63, so maybe a little bit muggy out there today, but the main story is going to be that breeze. You look at it out of the northwest at 17 miles per hour. And these are sustained winds across the state. Of course, we've seen gusts upwards of 30 miles an hour or so. And those are going to be staying strong as we head into the afternoon hours. So looking at Super Doppler right, right now, you can see that area of low pressure that brought in the storms kind of pinwheeling its way through Wisconsin. That's continuing to drag down some moisture and bring in cloud covered areas from Fort Dodge through the metro east towards Ottumwa and even a scattered shower or two up near Mason City. But looking regionally, we will eventually work in some drier air behind this. I got a chance at a stray shower, I'd say, down near Kansas City or so. But by and large, we will be clearing out after this system moves through. You can see kind of shooting just south of the Great Lakes there. And on the back edge of this, perhaps some patchy cloud cover as we head into your weekend. Otherwise, pretty calm out there. If you're traveling at all today, much warmer to the south. 102 for Dodge City. Middle 70s over the Great Lakes, 82 in the metro. St. Louis coming in at 95 degrees. So there is a whole lot of heat to our south, but we are riding in a little bit cooler air out there and much drier air. And your 12-hour forecast, not even a chance for rain. Look at the wind, though, out of the northwest at 15 to 25 miles an hour. That is going to continue into the evening hours, so likely not going to be catching a break from that. But again, we will catch a break from the clouds and the rain chances. Futurecast has just an isolated to scattered chance to the northeast into the evening hours. Notice the clouds still trying to hang on north of around 80 or so as we head into the morning. Those kind of briefly clear out and uh, as we head into Sunday, starting off the day with a little bit more sunshine out there. Clouds to the east still hanging on from that system. Your winds though, as we head into the day on Saturday, plan on those staying relatively strong. And as we head into Sunday, finally backing down into the single digits, you know, the single miles per hour, I should say. 82 degrees out there today, and tonight temperatures backing down into the middle 60s. So we're cooling off just a little bit, and we'll be a couple degrees below average. Looking around statewide here, we've got clouds clearing right now through central Iowa. 79 for Ames, Boone at 79. Highs for the day to the southwest in the low to mid 80s. And you look off to the northwest, 77 for Algona, Fort Dodge, 78 degrees. And we look off to the northeast, temperatures a little cooler, 77 for Hampton, Marshalltown coming in at 77, and to the southeast, upper 70s to low 80s. So your eight-day forecast, most days are looking pretty similar. 83 on Saturday this weekend is looking absolutely phenomenal. We hang tight with sunshine and dry conditions on Sunday, kicking off next week dry. And we do have some stray chances for rain by the middle of the week, but really going to be hit or miss, and even by the end of the week, we're only talking about low rain chances, so if people do need to get out, need to clean up, right. need to chop up the limbs that fell too, right. uh, this is, this is going to be a pretty good weekend. Yeah, glad.